Hey guys, what's up? I'll tell you what's up. I feel like I am the only person who actually waited until after Thanksgiving to get out my Christmas decorations. And I get it, I get it. It's been a hard year, everyone just wants a little bit of joy. But patience, people. Um, I may also be a little salty just because I love Halloween so much and I don't feel like I really got a Halloween this year. So I've just been putting it off a little bit. But today I have all of my Christmas stuff out and I am ready. I'm ready, it is officially December. So I had gotten out what I do have and then had a drop off of random things that I have to go through um, to put up and see what's in there and what we have. I had a small Christmas tree and then um, I got another not big one, it's about five feet. Might put one in the kitchen, might put one in the bedroom. I will have to move a couple chairs around. Uh, so we'll just kind of see where things fit and uh, see what all these boxes of things have in them. Um, the boxes have officially taken over the living room. So uh, let's get started. This is what we got going on in here. Alright, so I put this one up. This is a super small one, um, but I got this one up and kind of decorated with a few things. I'll probably be moving this one into the bedroom or the kitchen and then putting this one up in the living room where there's a little more space. But I do want to move this chair, so we'll start with getting some of that stuff out of the way. There's a few things that I put out. Um, I made these the other day. Uh, the ribbons need to be fixed a little bit, but if you see glitter all over the place, it's because of those. And I just haven't vacuumed it up yet because there's still lots to be put out. family really likes lights. Okay. 
Does anyone else have like nightmares about half of their strings of lights working and the other half not working? Because it just like really, really brings on the anxiety. And what am I going to do? I can't cut this in half. You know, it's worse than half of your lights working. Getting your lights on the tree and then only half of them working. All right guys, so before I knew that I was getting another tree, I used a whole package of Christmas balls that I really liked for those glass containers. Um, so I am just gonna use some of the random stuff I have left over. My mom sent over a package of blue and silver um, and then like another jar of some gold ones. But I think we're just gonna throw on some random ones and hope that it looks all right. It's not gonna be super coordinated, but uh, we'll try to match them so they look back. The amount of glitter in this house. Well, the tree is done. And, um, I think it's time for a snack. Lisa's part's done. <laughs> The floor is not. Ooh! We got all of the glitter everywhere. So it was getting a little too dark to film last night, but as you saw, I finished the tree and we got these nice shelves back here that are all done. Um, and there are just some little touches that I'm finishing up. I think things are starting to look good. Um, I'm going to have to start with some outside stuff, I guess.
these for the table. I do have to finish these. Right now they just have um, battery packs of lights in them. I'd like to mix in some ribbon or some Christmas balls in there. Um, so right now, yeah, they just have stuff sticking in them so they don't jiggle around on the table. But um, I think they're going to look really nice with a little bit of color in there with the lights and then um, these, which I absolutely love. These are all lights to go outside on the deck out there with the white and the baby tree. Look at Alexa on her little stand. She has her own pedestal. Uh, if you guys need someone to come over and decorate your house for you, uh, I'm available. Uh, I'm here all day. Give me a call. Um, I'll come put up a Christmas tree for you, uh, for a price of course. <laughs>